what is up guys welcome to another video and you're watching cb tech king live here so in today's video we are going to discuss about the latest patent leaks for in display fingerprint sensor for the upcoming 2018 iphone x lineup so without any further delay let's get this video started so iphone users love touch id in fact all smartphone users love fingerprint authentication Apple wasn't the first smartphone maker to add a fingerprint scanner to a smartphone but its implementation was a cut above everything else that was available at that time. Android smartphone makers rushed to add similar features to their smartphones and now every new phone in this world has a fingerprint sensor aside from extremely low cost phones for emerging markets. Then Apple went ahead and ditched the fingerprint sensor on the iPhone X. There is still some debate regarding exactly how this happened. Rumors suggest that Apple have tried to build an in-display fingerprint sensor into the iPhone X in addition to the Face ID but it couldn't get the tech ready for mass production in time. Apple says it never planned to add any type of fingerprint scanning feature on the iPhone X but still not everyone believes that to be true. In the end, all that matters is that the iPhone X doesn't have a fingerprint reader. Making matters even worse for the Touch ID fans is in the fact that when Apple unveiled the Face ID on the iPhone X at last year's press conference, it said that Face ID is the future and now it's moving away from the Touch ID on all its devices. Before you panic, however, there's something important you should keep in mind. Apple says a lot of things and then ends up backtracking them down. Remember when Jobs said Apple would never make an iPhone phablet? Yeah, we all know how that turned out. So Apple continues to instruct publicly that Face ID is replacing Touch ID. We also know that all three of these companies new 2018 iPhone models will have Face ID instead of Touch ID as will the new iPad Pro the company plans to launch next month. But while all this is going on in public, Apple continues to work behind closed doors on different ways to bring fingerprint sensor back to its devices and now it may have found the perfect solution that will allow to bring back Touch ID on devices that still have all screen displays like the iPhone X. As covered in a recent report from Patently Apple, the company has invented a new technology that could allow Apple to add fingerprint reading capabilities to devices without the need for a home button. A couple of China-based smartphone makers already offer phone models with optical image fingerprint sensors embedded in the display. Next year, Samsung is expected to become the first company to use ultrasonic fingerprint sensor technology on the Samsung Galaxy S10 and it will also be embedded in the displays. Apple's new patent covers technology that is different from either of affirmation solutions but the end game is the same. A user would be able to unlock an iPhone open and secure app or authentication on a mobile phone payment system by just placing her or his finger on the phone's display. So this was it from today's video guys. What do you guys think about the upcoming 2018 iPhone models and of course about this move which Apple is playing that they are working on an in-display fingerprint sensor under the dark room but you guys are just believing that Face ID is the future. Don't forget to tell me that thing in the comment section below and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet kindly do so for future tech videos. Peace out.